Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on your location. My name is Samuel Dr. Yacha. I want to bring you, as usual, the advanced method of Elliott wave analysis weekly forecast. Okay, so remember, if this is your first time of watching my analysis, subscribe, like, share, make your comments. You also need to know that we have a Telegram channel, YouTube, um, WhatsApp channel. We also have um, Slack. We have all the channel. We also have in our links channels to uh, link to open crypto accounts, Binance, OKX, all of them. Also, we have students group in our in our Telegram channel. We have two free Telegram channels where we share views, three setups randomly. But if, if you want to learn an advanced method of Elliott wave analysis and other, other technical analysis, that's the mentorship. We also have that group. You only, only need to contact me and pay the through money and give and we'll give you what we what you need. Okay, so now let, let, let's start as as usual. Here's why. Here's why so far so good. The market is still going our direction. We favor the buying. We say that whatever is happening here will be a pullback. And that's how you can see it and ABC. The proport from the structure it is making, from this structure, this correction is too too sharp. And 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 and, and, and most of the time when we have a sharp correction, we get double correction. But one thing here again is that this up move is also sharp. Had it been that uh, had it been that the, the correction is moving, uh, let me had, had it been that the, the up move is doing something like this, then surely you get this. But since this is sharp, we can only get this and this. So the buying continues. That's the message. The buying continues. Where is our target? We are coming to one. 16117. We might ultimately get to 120, but for now, the next target is 116.8, 117.6. This is our next target. So focus on that. I don't see any reason to sell now. I can only buy. The buying confirmed here. So let's move to next pair. Euro USD is, is the next pair. What do we have there? The pair is selling. As I, as I, as I told you most of the time, that Euro USD and DSY are going opposite direction. So you can see DSY is buying. Euro USD is selling. You can see it is selling. So no need to, no too much talk on that. <clears throat> it is selling, it's selling. What is our next target? Our, our next target is uh, 0 0.94. Or at least we will make a new low. We are going below 0 0.953. But ultimately, we're going to come to 0 0.943, 0 0.933, even 0 0.92. But for now, let's focus on this low. Break of this low, you might get correction before going down again, or total reversal. USD <clears throat> card. USD card. What do we have there? The pay is buying. Remember, we have a target on our weekly time frame. Here is our target. Either, either here, one point three nine or. 1.41, 1 1.43. So here is our target. So even the price, 
if, if the price is going down, remember, if it is going down, it is correction. But the price is going up. You can see the, the correction. Okay, let's see it on, on row four. Therefore, you can see an A, B, C. Okay, and the price is going back up. So what is our next target? 1.41, 1 1.417 is our next target on USD card. After that, either total reversal or we get a sell as correction. Next. USDTF. <clears throat> USDTF have been making a complex move. You know, from daily charts, the only thing that is uh, reasonable technically is this WXY. But you know, market can make simple correction and continue because, for instance, this ABC might have finished the correction. But for now, this move again seems to be a correction again. So if you don't have experience, there are so many places to trade. You can forget about USDHF now and focus on another place because of the the because of the way it, it, it is moving. For now, I cannot say whether the market will come here and reverse or whether we will first uh, get a pullback before coming here again and then come down. Definitely, the price the price we surely come down. But what I, what I can tell now is whether it will abandon the move and begin to go down from here. Or if it will just make a little move and go deep, we're just making a big move down. So the price action on PSDHF has been somehow uh, out of normal, normal movement. So you better ignore it. There are so many threats to take. Okay. Thanks, USD. Thanks, USD. What do we have? The price is going down. You see daily. The price is still going down. And what our last week analysis, we we expected the, the question to end ar around here. Last week, we thought the question will, will give us a simple ABC, maybe around here and go down. But it still, is, it went deeper. But here is our invalidation, you know. I, 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 as, long as, as long as it, 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 it doesn't close above this level, 1.172, it is still valid. So we still have started. Now, here is our uh, stop loss, even here. Okay, but let's leave it here for now. Stop loss, we still have confirmed. So let me delete it. Okay. AUD USD. AUD USD. What do we have? The price is going down. Can we see daily? Now, please note that the price has entered the reversal zone. Why am I showing you this? Once price entered a reversal zone, it can reverse without making a standard pattern in lower time frame. But for now, the next move is uh, 0 0.621, 0 0.617. This is the, the next target. And the market can reverse here. Uh, when it comes down here, it make correction and go down again. So, be cautious of that. And using the USD, they are doing the same thing, the same thing with uh, AUD USD. As you can see, the price is also going down. Where do we target? Maybe zero point five three or deeper, 0.53 or deeper. OK, but note again, let's see the reversal zone. The daily reversal zone, the price is already on the reversal zone. 
but they can know. But, but as I, I say always, the vessel zone is all this place. It can go deeper. It can end at this level. It can end at uh, zero point five five four six and zero point five six nine level. Or it will get deeper. I think it will get deeper between this zero point five four five and zero point five one five. So I expect a deeper move. But you know, it can reverse anywhere from here. Okay, if you didn't trade it from here down to here, maybe you be very careful and don't be greedy. Once the market goes in your favor, you move, your, you move your stop loss to break even. So because of this reason, here will be our stop loss. Here will be stop loss for now because the markets have broken, uh, have broken all the levels. If you watch here, it's broken. This one is broken, I guess. So let's be careful. JP225, Japan225. What do we expect? I need to show you the daily, the, the weekly charts because ultimately we are coming to 23,000 and uh, 21,500. This is the level we are coming. When will this happen? Maybe next year or towards or next month. Or towards the end. So let's see daily. Daily has given us a kind of ABC or one, two, three. For now, let's see for hours. That's where we take our trade. Now, we have two options here. One, this market is making an impulse. That is a big correction. That is an ABC. If it is an ABC, if this move is an ABC move, that is A, B, C, then expect the market to reverse somewhere here. But when market, when, when market opens and you see a sharp move again, then forget this, forget this. If market going to move sharp, but forget this, then you, you begin to count one, two, three, four, five. So that's what we are expecting. That's why I put this, I put up these two, two arrows. We have two possibilities, either it goes down or goes up. In my own calculation, it will go down. But you know, as I say always, nobody controls the market. I don't control the market. I saw all this fall, and I show you this from here. I show you this fall. So it's a very big, massive move, OK? Now, we can get another sharp fall again, or we may get this move up before another big sell. So sell is still coming, but not sure whether it, it has it's affected here or it will move up again before it begins to fall again. OK? I have seen, I have shown you the daily chart, so let's go to UJPY. UJPY, what do we have here? Uh, do, can we get a daily entry on daily? UJPY uh, on daily, we have talked the reversal zone, but we likely go deeper into it. So now let's focus on. Lower time frame, or let's see this weekly. Let's see now weekly. Weekly and daily telling us we are entered the reversal zone and the which we may see go deeper. But mind you, whenever we confirm that the markets have reversed, expect a big sell. We can even come down to 100, 120, 100, but maybe next year or towards year end. For now, Let's check our four hours to know what we are, what we do next. So now four hours, this, this is one, two, three, four, five. So logically, what we get is buy. Buy towards 145, 146. So maybe after this buy, we may get that big sell we are expecting. Okay, can you see one hour? 
Now, one on one, what I show you, what I show you this one on one is allow the market to break this to confirm that this ABC is over because it can keep dropping gradually. I have seen such. It, 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 moving like this. So if you enter the blind view, if you keep drawing you and keep going down, but allow it to go above this level, then you can buy and target one, one, one for five, one for six, as I told you. Okay, let's go to next pen. Yes, it's JPY. Here's the JPY. What do we have there? The market refused to move. The market refused to move. So maybe, I don't know why it is, but it, it's able to move. This is the way for, I expect it to give us a kind of nice correction and begin to go up. But it's just going sideways. Now, two things is what we expect in this situation. One, you may get a sharp move. And that sharp move up, or we may get a little move like this and sharp move up. So for now, I don't trade this pair now because I don't like how it is behaving. I closed my position, I bought from here, but I closed it because I don't like how it is moving. It didn't give me an impulse move, so I closed it. So, pounds JPY. Pounds JPY, what do we have here? Pounds JPY is uh, showing us something, not like you go JPY, on weekly. Expect a sharp sell element from now because the reversal zone press have touched it, but we expect it to go deeper, to, deeper in the reversal zone. This sharp drop was somehow a signal that the correction might be over. This sharp, okay, let me sh show you the, the, the sharp move on daily. You can see this sharp move. Is there a sign that selling have started? Okay, now, well, I'm sure from experience, I have seen sharp move, sharp move down. So this move is sharp. This again is sharp. But you might be expecting the, this move to give you something like this, a kind of A, B, C, and then buy again. If you keep going down, down, so it can happen. So that's why I'm showing you all these things. Now, let's go to daily, sorry, to four hours to know if we have anything to trade coming week. Now, four hours, okay, let me go down, down to one hour. One hour have a good structure. This structure is a good structure. It shows the kind of A, B, C, or W, X, Y, X, Z. So this channeling uh, is a. Uh, in fact, I, if I, I'm uh, if I have to vote both sides, possibility of going down from here is there. But I can say. Going down from here is 30%. Then doing this, breaking this channel and go up is 70%. So I expect if price breaks this channel, I will buy it and I will target, maybe I will target maybe 168, 169 or even 170. But let it break this channel first. So about, no, what we know that this is the the last push up we get. After that, expect a heavy sell. After that, that move, expect a heavy sell. So now let me give you more illustration. If this, if, if the market breaks this level, we, we, we're gonna get one, two, three, four, five. If you give us a five waves move up. Okay, that's what we expect if the market breaks this channel in an impulsive manner anyway. Let me be clear. Because it can it can go up sluggishly and go down. Okay, if not if you don't understand that, 
maybe you need more knowledge, join our students and you learn. Let's go to gold. Gold, uh, gold, silver, gold, silver, platinum are kind of making some surprises. You know, last week, I expected gold, let, let me show you last week, my, my expectation was that gold will reverse somewhere here and go down. I was expecting gold to give us a kind of A, B, C that we end here, kind of A, B, C, maybe around here, and begin to go down. But it gives us what looks like an impulse. Now, it is not, it is, this move is impulsive, but the structure is incomplete if it is an impulse. Now, how do we approach this? Simple, we see it as one, two, three. If you get the first half from here, it will be four and five. But I have seen this, it can be possible an A, B, C, and you see it's continue going down. So for now, I suggest you watch gold closely or one hour. Gold, silver, platinum. In the one hour, show that this is correction, that we get one more push up. But I have seen many times when we'll be expecting market to go up, it's rather go down. So now, if you are if you are buying gold, allow it to give us the first push up, so that here will be stop loss. I mean, don't trade with the beach stop loss because it can turn back and go down. Okay, let me take more time to show you something again on gold. Now, this this is weekly time frame gold. Gold have reached, have entered the reversal zone. Make no mistake about that. Gold have reached the reversal zone. Daily again, this is the reversal zone. Okay, so when I'm showing you this, you need to be careful. Then, as long as this level have to be broken, gold can still consider as selling. So. You uh you follow it with caution. If you get five waves, maybe one, two, three, four, five, then watch the ABC, whether it will be corrective or it will be impulsive. That's what I can tell you about gold. Silver, the same thing. Silver, the same thing. You can see the, the shape is like is like. One, two, three, A, B, C, let me label it, A, B, C, A, B, C. So, Silver is more clear than gold. You can count clear five waves. Or let me say clear four waves. One, two, three. This is typical of A, B, C. So in that case, uh, I of course I would rather I would rather buy silver than buy buy gold. Okay, if I get this drop, I can buy silver from here and target and target to here uh, twenty one. 22 or thereabouts. But for now, let's keep watching. Platinum. Platinum, the same shape with silver, though the count is not the same. One, two, one, A, B, C, two, one, two, three. I was sent to for so platinum, platinum again. Uh, expect the price to buy from here. Target will be uh, above 951, 960, 970, 990, 9, 9, even 1000. We can look at 1000 before we sell again. But overall, let's see daily. Platinum is suggesting. Uh, 
Continue, Mr. Continue, Mr. Continue, Mr. After this move, you can see daily. Never take your eyes off bigger time frame. Never forget bigger time frame while you are trading. So you must continue to say that this is an ABC, that we have another impulse down after this. And that, in, that, uh, in that case, continue might go as low as 730, 720, 680, 640. So the possibility is there. But as I say always, not a must that it will happen. Not a must, but technically, that's what I can see. A, B, C, then another move like this. Either five waves moves or something similar to this. Okay, so uh, what again? Uh, US oil, surprise of the week. US oil, that now this is, yeah, uh, US oil is why I always, now, I, I mean, whenever, uh, Whatever I'm saying, whenever I'm saying when market comes to when market comes to reversal zone, you be careful. For instance, let me zoom this chart. For instance, based on lower time frame, I was expecting US or you to to give me this. To drop to this level before going up, you see. So this is why you always be careful when we get comes to the side zone because it will go deeper. It will just uh, reverse after the two move into this zone. So now, had it been that I wasn't careful and sold oil and I I expect this thing, then I would have I would have uh, made a loss. But I was watching it to give me a proper uh, structure that show that it will drop. I haven't seen it. So, see, there's something you must know. You must know uh, setup. If you don't know it, you'll be blowing your account. You must know and recognize setup. Buy setup, sell setup. That, uh, that the market suggests that we, we go down doesn't mean it will go down until you see sell setup or buy setup. So, this is why I, I, I encourage you. If you don't know, if you don't know all this, see, all, all this uh, role in our class, you don't charge much. Then, uh, so this is why I, I, I will tell you: be careful when we get enters the basal zone. Okay, now on daily chart, we on our, our, our time frame, we are expecting it to go deeper, but it turned and made a big move. I didn't buy this because I was looking for sell. This is a very big move. But I don't regret missing a trade because I know opportunities come almost every time. So having said this, let's not go down to four hours. Remember, this is the beginning of the move. We still have a very, very far place to go. Okay. Having missed this, I doesn't, it doesn't matter. I will look for buy the top again. I don't look for set the top again. I'm looking for buy setup now, as long as all you is consigned. I'm not even looking for so a break of this level and the break of this channel shows oil is no longer selling, at least for now. Okay, I don't know how I don't know what, what I will explain again on oil. I'm taking my time to explain everything for you. Let's go to Nasdaq, US 100. Yes, hundred. That's that. What do we have? Let me show you something on daily. So now you remember months ago, I keep telling you what bit of W, X, Y, X, Z. Now it, it has become a reality. So I won't waste time, but I will show you many indices that are doing the same sport. So now what is the next thing to do? Look for okay. Now you, you can see all these places reversal zone. As you can see, it is clear that it will go very deep into the reversal zone. If it didn't reverse, it came here and go up. It, you can see it's coming down again. So you need much knowledge to handle this. So now 
and what I'm looking for to get a set it up to sell this. We are coming deeper. That's all, all I can tell you on this. We are coming deeper. As a as a deeper from dread. As a deeper from dread. The same thing is happening. Let, let me show you barely. You can see it. WSYXZ. So watch out for 3,115, 3,090. And the is coming down to 3,000 level. I know two ways about it. We are starting. You also watch out for, you can see WSYXZ. Watch out for price to, to 8,400, to 8,000, even to 7,000. The price is still coming down. Uh, anyone again? Many of them are doing the same thing. I, know, I, I need to, just to, show, to show you about few. Many of them do the same structure. They're all still going down, down. Same is still going down, so I'll end here. I want to do a separate video for crypto. So now, subscribe, like, and share. Join our Telegram channel, they are all free, except you want to learn how to analyze technically. Then you inbox me, and I'll tell you what to do. You join us. We have already made, we have, we have some lessons we will begin to learn. It immediately and uh when it's time for questions and answers we we fix the time that will suit you thank you for joining me thank you for watching god bless you